you already know who it is. It's your boy Case back with another video. And as you see in the title, man, we this is we got a little story time for y'all. I know there's a lot of people been waiting for this story time. Like, damn, how'd you lose your virginity? Who would you lose it to? I feel like I think only a couple of my dogs know who I lost my virginity to. I think Mikey. I think that's it. Mario and Josh. I don't think that's I think damn, that's crazy. I think that's the only niggas that know. Probably Sean. Probably. I don't know what Philly know. That's crazy. Wow. I did not tell this story to anyone. I probably didn't want to tell anybody because I guess I got I was embarrassed from what grade I lost it in, but nah, I don't give a fuck. I fuck. Wow. Whoa. Well, I am. I don't fuck plenty of bitches. I meant to say this. Hold on, I need a spit. Yeah, currently I'm in my bathroom. Every time you see this shit, I'm in my bathroom. Like, no cap, because one, my brother's in the, in the room, he's annoying. My other brother and sister's in the other room, and they on the phone with my cousin. Shout out to my nigga Magid. I don't even know if you watch my videos, but shout out to my nigga Magid. Fuck with you. Malia, my auntie Rosie, Maya, Mike. Mikey, I see Mikey all the time, but shout out to them. I love them. Francesca, shout out to Feline, shout out to Pharrell. Uh, that's pretty much it. I think that's the only cousins I really fuck with like that. But anyways, let's get into the story time, man. Hey, man, this is how your boy lost his virginity. You feel me? So, hey, man. <clears throat> so, it was, I was in 11th grade. I was in 11th grade. I think I just turned 17. Oh, I was 16. No, I was definitely 17. Yeah, I was talking to two bitches, man. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna say the two bitches' names, but we gonna give we go we go give them we go give them names though. The other one will be Tiffany. The other one will be um damn. They gonna know who they are if they see this video. That's crazy. And the other one was um what's the other one? We call her Leah. We gonna call her Leah. So I was talking to Tiffany and Leah. One was dark, one was black, and one was like Spanish or whatever you want to call it. So yeah, it was two, it was two, it was two of them. I ain't gonna lie. So, Tiffany was thick as hell, but she was just, she feel me, she was a little ugly. I'm sorry, once you see this video, I am sorry. I didn't mean to say this. I still fuck Tiffany though to this day, but things happen, you feel me? <clears throat> And actually, you know it's crazy. I was still fucking on um well not to this day, not to this day, not to this day, not to this day. I'm tripping, I'm tripping. Not to this day, but you feel me? You know what I mean, you feel me? I wouldn't fuck her, but I would, but not anymore, you feel me? And um what's with the other one I called her? Leah? Leah I actually fucked her. Uh yeah, I fucked her a couple like what like a couple weeks ago. We had a little sick uh, situation ship. We was not. We were just a little friends with benefits thing. You feel me? You go see this video. You go be like. You probably go text me. And be like, wow, what the fuck? But fuck it, yeah, feel me. This is for my dogs. This is for my. This is for the games for the four hour clan. You feel me? But hey, I ain't gonna lie to y'all boys. I'm kind of nervous telling this story because this story is crazy. It's not crazy, but it's like wow, nigga. Nobody knew this shit. You niggas probably like y'all the fifth person I told, bro. So it's feel special. I know I need a haircut. I got a fat ass pimple right here that will be popped in like after this vid. I'm just waiting to I shower so it can be clean and shit and make sure nothing's on my face, you feel me? But anyways, yeah, so I was talking to Tiffany, I was talking to Leah. So I was talking to two breezes at the same time, junior year, you feel me? I was the man coming through. I said, you feel me? I was looking clean, a little fight. <laughs> you feel me? So like, I was talking to two breezes. I was like, damn, I don't know which one of these phones I'm gonna lose my virginity to. Cause it was like, I had, I had an option. I'm not gonna lie to you, I had an option. So, I thought I was gonna lose it to Leah, but it's crazy I ended up losing it to Tiffany first. So like, so I was, um, what day was it? It was the day, it was the day that I hit her at. It was crazy, I lost it at my old middle school. I fucked her at my old middle school. I fucked her at my old middle school. So basically what happened was, I think I was with Leah at school. Oh my gosh, I am a lit ass nigga. I'm sorry if I'm um, thinking, but that same day before I went to go smash Tiffany, I went to go smash, I got head from Leah. I know, ladies, I'm sorry, call me what you want. 
you a disgusting bastard, ugly piece of shit, ain't shit, fuck boy, whatever you want to call me. I ain't gonna lie, for my niggas, I got sucked up the same day I lost my virginity from another girl. So I got sucked up in the whip. This was my dog, my double homeboy Zay. Shout out to Zay, he doing his little thing with his music shit. I got sucked up in his car, you feel me? The head was straight, don't get me wrong. You feel me? I, she did her little thing. I think I, I think I bust, I bust, you feel me, on her. Like, she ain't gonna be busting her mouth though. Like, damn, Leah, you tripped. Like, she did I bust on her hands and shit. So then after that, um, you feel me? We was chilling, we was talking. Skipped on to go and hang with Tiffany. Tiffany, she didn't go to the same school I did. Leah, she did, you feel me? At that time, this is my, yeah, at the time. They were sophomores, I was junior. I was a junior. So it was like a year after me, like a year after me, for me, year of age as well. So basically, after that, uh, I started talking to Leah. I was still talking to Leah. Was I still talking to her? I don't know. But yeah, to Leah, we left, skip on, fucking, um, Tiffany went to a whole nother school. She went to a whole nother school, but she was thick as hell. Like, I couldn't let that go, you feel me? And it was crazy. Before I started talking to her, she told she told me I was a catfish. She probably wouldn't even remember this, but she told me I was a catfish. And Tiffany was not even all that, you feel me? I'm not even gonna lie. You got some little ass on you, I'm on your ass. I'm not even gonna lie. Ask my homeboys. I tell them boys all the time. You can be a little ugly, but that shit thick. You can get this dick. But yeah. So basically, after school, it was a long time. It was a little bit after school. Wow. I met her at my old middle school. If you, if you know who I am, you know who my old middle school is. I'm not gonna say the name because it's gonna go detail into the story. I probably said my old middle school in past videos, but oh well. I'm not saying it right now. But yeah, dog. So <clears throat> we was in the bathroom. We was like in the bathroom um, at my old middle school. We were just chilling. I was my heart over here. My heart thumping. I'm scared as fuck. <laughs> I was scared as fuck. I'm like, I wasn't scared. I was like, yes, I'm about to lose my shit. I'm about to lose my shit. I'm like, thank God. I'm looking at this girl. I'm like, damn, her ass look bad in my bed. I'm like, geez, all right, I gotta tap these. I gotta. I have one condom. One. Condom. I'm talking about. I think I still have the messages to these day, to this day when she when I when I lost my virginity to her. That's crazy. I do. Nah, I want to expose her. Should I? Nah, cause some of y'all know who she is. But yeah, after that, you feel me? Anyways, yeah, we was in the um who was that? We was in the bathroom. We was chilling. I'm just feeling on that ass, you feel me? That ass fatter than a muppy, you feel me? That ass, see you see, see the shower shit. That's like no I'm in the bathroom. But yeah, that ass fat. I'm like, damn, I'm slapping on it. Thicker than a bit, slim. I'm like, jeez. I'm like, hey man, we fucking doggy style out the gate. She said, okay, okay. You feel me? So she had a thong on. I'm like, damn. And I'm not even gonna lie to y'all, boys. For my ladies, I'm sorry. I love a girl that wear a thong. You could be skinny, petite, thick as hell. But I don't. it don't matter. If you got a thong on, I love that shit. Like, I love that shit. Like, we can fuck, keep the thong on. Like, type shit. Like, bro, I love that shit. Like, thongs, fit the best panties in the world. But I love that shit. Fucking keep the thong on. I don't even wanna take it off. I'll pull it to the side. I'm no crazy, you feel me? But yeah, you feel me? She had a thong on, she looking right thick as fuck. I'm like, jeez. The first one I'm about to fuck is thick as hell. I had to give myself some props. I gave myself a little pat on the back in my head. So I'm like, alright, I'm about to dive in. So I, I pulled out the condom. I'm looking at it, I'm like, damn, which way it go? I'm dead ass, I think I practiced how to put on a condom the, the day before. But yeah, I'm practicing like some J. Cole shit, you remember what he said? It's my first time, she was in my math class. But yeah, I think that's when that shit dropped too. That's the crazy thing, that's when that album dropped. But yeah, you feel me? Anyways, I had a condom, I'm like, man, I think I put it wrong on wrong the first time. So I kind of like moved it and I flipped it back on and I put it on. I'm like, boom, okay, the condom on. I'm trying to stick it in, I'm sticking it in. That bit tighter than a bit. I'm like, damn, this shit tight. I'm trying to stick it in. I'm like, damn, this shit tight. Like, this shit is like, real deal tight. So I'm like, I'm, I'm like, bitch, her ass fat as fuck. So I'm like, damn, ain't nothing. So I'm like, okay, let me just try again. So I put it back in. If you remember, I'm doing like little baby strokes, you feel me? Cause I'm like, I'm not trying to nut quick. So I'm doing the baby trucks, you feel me? Just to stretch it out a little bit. So it's stretching now, I'm stretching now. I'm going crazy after this. So I get the. 
straight like those. So I'm, I'm hitting it, I'm hitting it. I'm like, jeez, I grab the ass cheek. You know how you just grab one ass cheek, you just bam, 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 bam. I'm like, damn. Well, like five minutes later, seven minutes later, I'm probably I'm like seven minutes in, ten minutes in. I'm like, and then I just I told this girl, this is the only time I, this is the first and one, this is the one and only time I ever told a bitch I was about to nut. I told that girl, hey, I'm about to come, you feel me? And then she was like, oh, she, I don't know what she said. She was just moaning. She said, did I nut her? With a condom. Now I nut on her ass. Did I? Hey, I'm not lying. But so I'm hitting, I'm hitting her, I'm about to nut. I'm nutting. I'm like, oh my god, bro. Like this was the best nut ever. Like I used to jack the fuck out my dick, but this was like the best nut ever. I'm like, oh my gosh. Like my whole body just trembled and just. You feel me? I'm like, like I just call a seizure type shit. I'm like, damn. I had no shirt on, just clapping them cheeks. I'm like. Yeah, bro, that, that girl was thick as fuck, bro. I was just clapping. That's, that was it. Oh, my gosh. And we got caught. We got caught. So uh, we smashed it. Someone knocks on the door. And I think we was in the boys' bathroom or the girls' bathroom. I don't remember, but we was in the boys' bathroom or the girls' bathroom. And I was hitting her. And then I stopped. I nutted. You feel me? I'm trying to, like, throw. I mean, you know, I'm doing a condom check out the gate. He ain't lying. So I, 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 mean, I put water inside the condom. I squeezed that hole. I'm making sure nothing comes out. So nothing did, you feel me? I'm like, okay, I threw away the condom. So then someone knocks on the door. I'm like, damn, he hear me and her, you feel me? We were smashing, you feel me? And we, at the end, we were just talking like it was nothing, like no one was there, like we in our own room type shit. And then he, this man just knocking on the door. He knocks on the door. I'm like, damn, I'm fucked. I'm like, fuck it, I don't give a fuck. I'ma tie my face, I'm gone. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing they can do to me. Ain't shit they can tell me I'm a buck. So then, that's when I, um, what? We walked out. Bro just looking at us. Some Spanish short looking nigga. He just looking at us. I'm like, shit. I'm looking, I'm looking like fucking one of them um, terrorist niggas when they tie their shirt and they only, only see their eyes type shit. That's how I'm looking. I'm, this nigga just looking at me, no shirt. I, I, I literally just look like I just smashed her. So I'm like, okay. And then that's when he just saw me. He, he ain't say nothing to us. We just walked past, bro. And I'm like, all right, ain't nothing then. So then I went home. Who picked me up? Jeff. Jeff picked me up. Y'all probably know that's episode sauce. That nigga picked me up. I'm like, no, I didn't, he didn't pick me up. I told him to pick me up. He came to pick me up. I was so happy I walked home. I walked all the way home. I'm like, bro, I'm happy as a bitch. I walked all the, all the way home. I got the Sean crib. Them boys called me. They're like, where you at? I'm like, I'm at Sean House. They're like, how the fuck you get to Sean House so fast? I'm like, hey, man, I don't know. I was happy as a bitch. I was funked out. I was like the happiest kid in the world at that moment. <clears throat> so then after that, that's when, like, the next day, I'm hearing um some bitch. It's crazy because, anyways, I'm going to say it. I'm going to let y'all know. But basically, what happened after that, the next day, I hear some shit like, oh, some bitch was being called a thought that went to that my old middle school. She was probably like, I don't know. They thought I raped some bitch. They thought I raped some bitch. I'm like, no, 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 I'm not with the rape business. You're tripping. They called me up to the office at my school. They thought I raped some bitch. They like, nah, man, I was, I was not with that, with that girl. You tripping. I was not with that girl. She, that girl was probably like in eighth grade and I was in, what I said, 11th grade? Yeah, or 10th. I don't remember. I don't know if this was 10th or 11th grade. Like, I did ass, don't remember. But yeah, she was in eighth grade, she was in 10th or 11th. I that ass don't remember, that's crazy. I don't know if I was 16 or 17, I don't remember that shit. But yeah, the next thing they said basically that I was, I checked out rape some eighth grader type shit. I didn't rape her, they, say, they basically say like, oh, you fucked her, and you know that's rape. Cause, cause that's considered rape, you know what I'm So I'm like, whoa, 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 I didn't do that, sir. So, <clears throat> They, they let me know, they, they basically said, oh yeah, this not him, he, he tripping, he didn't do that. They saw the camera, they saw who the girl was, they got the girl wrong. I'm like, wow, how y'all mix up these two girls, you see? Because the girl used to do some shit at the school over there. So they got the two girls mixed up. So I'm like, okay, they got it all resolved and shit. 
and then boom. And you know what's crazy? That same girl that they said that I, um that they tried to get me in trouble with, probably like three, four years later, we end up fucking. But that's the story time for another day. This video is pretty long, so hey man, this video is done for. That's how I lost my virginity, dog. I'm pretty sure most people want to know how to fuck and who the hell I lost it to. Still won't say her name, Tiffany. Of course she was straight, you feel me? It was good. Her ass was fat as fuck. Yeah, it was, it was, it was pretty good. That was, a good. that was a good sexual experience, you feel me? I, I wouldn't clap her down for like a couple months then we just ended up stopping talking. We, we, we cool to this day, you feel me? That's enough I'm being saying. But hey man, that's the end of this video, man. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe if you're new. Giveaway at 1.2K. Right now, I see us, we had 1,192. Eight more subscribers for another giveaway, bro. Make sure you subscribe, man. Make sure to follow us on IG. Make sure you follow all of us if you want to get this, bro. I, I, I ain't playing no games. We having four of them holes, four PSN codes. So once I drop four of them bitches, yeah, better make sure y'all subscribe. Y'all like our videos, y'all follow us on social media, and get straight into it, <clears throat> Make sure to share it to all your friends and all that shit, you feel me? So yeah, man, this is the end of this video. Love y'all for a game, 1.2K. We got another giveaway. Forever.